हेरिडिटी इंट्रोडक्शन द ट्रांसमिशन ऑफ ट्रेट्स और कैरेक्टर्स फ्रॉम पेरेंट टू ऑफ स्प्रिंग इज कॉल्ड हेरिडिटी फॉर एग्जाम्पल द ऑफ स्प्रिंग ऑफ हॉर्सेस आर हॉर्सेस Inherited traits The child looks similar to his parents because the child inherits their traits such as earlobe attachments eye color curly hairs gene DNA contains specific sections which contains information to synthesize proteins such sections are called as genes genes are responsible for traits in an organism genes are passed from parent to offspring allele organisms population may have different forms of same genes called as allele for example genes that gives red color to petals and genes that give white color to petals of a flowering plant are allele mendel's laws for inheritance of traits Mendel formulated laws for inheritance of traits based on the fact that both parents that is mother and father contributes equal quantity of genetic material that is DNA to the child Now there is a question that if both parents are contributing equal quantity of DNA then which characters would show up in the child to find the answer mendel conducted various experiments on garden pea plant that is pigeon sativum during his experiments he examined visible characters such as tallness or shortness red color or white color of flower round or wrinkled seed axial or terminal position of flower green or yellow colored pod gray or white color of seed coat etc during his experiment he took pea plants having different characteristics such as p plant having red flower and plant having white flower he then produced next generation of p plant that is progeny from these plants and then calculated the percentage of plants having red or white flowers based on his research he formulated three laws these are law of segregation it states that during formation of gametes the allele for each gene separates from each other such that each gamete carry one allele for each gene law of independent assortment it states that during formation of gametes different allelic pairs separate independently thus the pair of allele responsible for petal color segregate independent of the allele pair that is responsible for growth law of dominance it states that dominant allele always mask recessive allele 
in a pair of allele if one allele is dominant then only the effect of dominant allele shows up in the organism